Okay, so here we've got a little statue to Hamlet. Hamlet is one of Shakespeare's characters and here he is meditating on the skull and I think it has something to do with Yorick or whatever in the play Hamlet. Possibly meditating on the nature of life and death. Fortunately in the Bible it does say that death has lost its sting now that the Prince of Life has come and conquered death. And so even though the saying goes that the two certainties in life are taxes and death, there's an overriding certainty that the Bible reveals that Jesus, the Prince of Life, the author of life, has come to conquer death. And so death is something that has lost its power because there is an eternity that we can enjoy now. The Bible says in John chapter 17 verse 13 that this is eternal life that we might know Him. And we can know Him through Jesus, that's God, the supreme God of the universe. We can know Him and conquer the fear of death. So death is really not an issue now that we've come into a relationship with God because life is defined as a relationship. And the relationship that we have with God through Jesus is an eternal thing. And so if we meditate on these things, the higher truth of the Word of God supersedes any of man's meditations. But sorry about that Hamlet, it's just the way things are. When the truth comes, it sets you free. And whom the Son is set free is free indeed. We're here in Stratford, on Avon. Shakespeare country in the United Kingdom and the Cotswolds in the year June of our Lord 2010